Salutations, everybody. Okay, so I can do a lot of this. Um, we got the key to this door, but I need to be light loaded and I'm overloaded right now because I'm carrying scale armor and a long sword and a short bow and a dagger. Uh, there are traps galore here. The key point is we have to, to navigate two people through here. Okay. And Shadowheart should not be walking around with me because she's an idiot. She would trigger all these traps and we don't want to trigger the traps. They're bad. I just, I just found a potion of glorious Volta. And I just literally walked over a trap without triggering it. Awesome. As if stealth. Um, okay. Iron Gate. Open. Uh, I'm going to actually steal who do you want to call it from you? Ale for this. Because okay. I know it. Salutations. I, I know what to do. Also, why am I crouching? I'm not entirely yeah, sure. Uh, stealth doesn't do much when you're all by yourself. Um, okay. So, there's this hidden door here, and you actually can get through it. And literally, this puzzle took me all of two seconds to figure out. You have to sit in the two chairs. <laughs> like, the first time I saw it, I went, oh, I have to sit in the chairs. Like, there, there, was, there was no complexity here. It was just, like, my instinct reaction was, must sit in chairs to trigger it. I don't know where I've seen this puzzle before, but I've seen it somewhere. There we go. Okay. Time to get the loot. Uh, careful though, the traps are still very active. Yeah, I'm just staying right there. And there is a trap here, and I have not managed to disarm it. Which did that. Oh. At least both of all our characters are sitting. Um, I don't know if I have anything to do specifically. A Gale is now dying. Oh, um, the toxin is all the way back at the beginning, too. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to loot everything before I go down. We can go in turn-based mode, maybe. Uh, we may need to. Uh, Shadowheart's dying. Yeah, I noticed. And uh, now, yeah, so... Uh, here, um... Here are the other two. Take care of them. I'll deal with looting. Moment. I can have me run in, because I'm at full health, so... Yeah. Uh... Resistant to poison damage. I had an elixir of it. Oh, and it's gone now. At least where I am, it faded. Oh, and I'm out of movement. You gonna, um, you gonna be able to save her? Yeah, I can. I can get her up. Okay, you're gonna have to get Gale out of there eventually, anyhow. So, and now that he's gotten up, I'm locked in the room. Uh, awesome. Oh. Um. Okay. Uh, here. Why don't I toss you one of the poison uh, resist poison items I had in my inventory? Uh, where was I? Had another one. A oh, potion of toxic resistance. Who should I put it on? Um, Gale, maybe. He's um, the most likely to go down, right? Other than Shadowheart. Well, Shadowheart is going to have one HP when she stands ah, back up. So. Okay, it's in Shadowheart's inventory. Okay. I'll have Gale sit back down. Oh, he was still getting poisoned even in that chair, by the way. Yeah, I know that, but so you can get out if you need. Okay, I'm not going to bother looting anything else from here. I'm going to do a dash and get out. Oh, I've also, I'm heavily encumbered. So let me get rid of some. Was the target too far? Pathing maybe. Okay, so Shadowheart literally got up, and now use heal. She's got heals. I'll um. Should I take her back now? Uh. Yeah, I'll take her back. Yeah. My face protects me. So now Gail is good to go. Take you. Well, as good as one can be when you're in a space where we're all getting poisoned. So, uh, exit turn basing road and running. I'm gonna run over all the traps, too. I've got Shadowheart out. Don't run over the traps. There's plenty of traps. Still, how am I still encumbered? 
I gave away like 80% of my value. Well, oh, stupid silver ingot, maybe? And armor. Oh, boy. I can't, literally, I can't carry anything anymore. Because I've got so much food in my pack. It's 144 pounds of food in our we pack. We can drop off the food at camp. Yeah, we're going to have to. You made it out? Yeah, we're out. Okay. Um, we... Well, there's loot outside, right? I think. Uh, I got some of it. Not all of it. Okay, because there's plenty of bodies out here. I am going to trigger a short rest, though. Just so in case we do get into a fight, it's not insta-death. True. What's hiding here? I got a hand drum. I don't think there's any point in searching those bodies, because it's all just gnolls. Oh, there could be something over here. Here, but I doubt it. There's a random severed leg. Look. Uh, I think we go back to the grove. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be back at there, the grove. There are some other fights we can do in the area. Yeah, but we need to long rest. And if we want to see if about maybe curing Carlax, I don't know if we can without actually resting. Um, we need to go talk to blacksmith. I think. I think? I don't know for sure. Okay, so back to the grove. Yes, back to the grove. Well, I think potentially we could go to camp and we just not actually sleep. Like, leave camp without sleeping. Might work yeah. as well. I don't know if we need car Oh my lunch. gosh. What's wrong? Yellow's arcane hunger again. Really? That was fast. You said it was like three times total. It's been three times already. That is pretty insane. Um, okay, you take care of that. I'm going to go to camp. Oh, yes, you can just go to camp. Perfect. Yeah. I'm going to go to camp. I'm going to switch Shadowheart out for Carlatch. Although I think I have to deal with uh, the nonsense with Will first. Um, let's see. Uh, took care of the Paladins of Tear. Glad to... Wish I could have been there. To hear that. There we go. Won't be seeing my heart is an infernal soon, engine. So I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close. Uh, Smith who worked in hells there. for a time. Maybe I could make his acquaintance. Maybe even manage a pat or bump without burning someone to death. It's been a long time. Let's go find your friend before I blow a gasket. Lead on. Okay, so if I do. Okay. You have Shadowheart to stay behind. Shadowheart, where are you? Makes my day better. I'd give we Gale something nonsensical. Now that we have Carla, if you're okay. sure. Something useless. Fine. Hello, Shadowheart. I'll be here when you rediscover your taste in company. What can I do? Hold on, I'm having a big convo with Gale. He said it wasn't having any effect and they need to speak to us. Uh uh do, do, do. come on, we're heading out. Okay. Do you want me to jump into this? You have to know who oh, I am. Oh, there we go. You might want to. Yeah. You have to know who I am. Perfect time. I'm... What I am is a walking shadow of the promise I once held. I'm what one might call a wizard prodigy. Who from an early age could not only control the weave, but compose it. Much like a musician or a poet. Such was my skill that it earned me the attention of the mother of magic herself. The lady of mysteries. The goddess Mistra. She revealed herself to me and she became my teacher. In time, she became my muse. And later, even my lover. Okay. <laughs> I'd say option two. Who would dare reduce a goddess to a muse? I like option one, too. Go with whatever you want. I want to see option oh, one. We enjoyed each <laughs> That's it. Company. Oh, yes. Body, <laughs> mind and soul but even so i desired more you see no matter how powerful a wizard we mortals can become we never scratch more than the surface of the weave mistra keeps us in check there are boundaries she doesn't let us cross yet every time i was with her i stood on the precipice gazing into the wonders that lay beyond I sought to cross her boundaries. 
Uh oh. Uh. Uh, you thought you knew better than Mister. You're more of a fool than I thought. Don't pick that one. <laughs> I think option one. Yeah, option one. I tried to convince her. I pouted. I pleaded. I swore my ambition was only to serve her better. But she only smiled and told me to be contented. But inconceivable as it seems to me now, I shared a bed with a goddess. And yet I wasn't satisfied. So I sought to prove myself worthy to her instead. We come now to the crux of my folly. Shall I share the story behind it, or would you rather head straight to its sordid finale? Sordid finale. Straight to the sordid phase. Suffice it to say, I obtained an obscure and ancient book that had locked away inside a much coveted prize. It was a fragment of primal weave locked out of time, locked away from Mistra herself. What if, I thought, what if... After all this time, I could return this lost part of herself to the goddess. What an idiot. I was certain that this deed of raw power, draped in romance, would convince Mistra to take me by the hand and welcome me into her hitherto forbidden domains. I was mistaken. I obtained the fabled book and took it into my study. As for what happened next... Here. Place your hand over my heart. Let me show you. I don't even know that I want to, but I guess I'm going to. <laughs> yep. Oh, that's not you good. Feel the tadpole quiver as you realize Gale is letting you in into the dark. Uh -uh. You see through Gale's eyes, staring down the corridors of a dread memory. The book bowed and suddenly opened. Inside there are no pages, only a swirling mass of blackest weave that pounces. Its teeth, its claws, it's unstoppable as it digs through and becomes part of you. And gods, is it ever hungry? Uh oh. Ah. Uh, that's not good. Huh. Uh, take, yank your hand away, or how are you still alive? Thankfully, the moment I absorbed the fragment wasn't enough to kill me outright. It was only the beginning. This netherese blight, this orb, for lack of a better word, is balled up inside my chest. And it needs to be fed. As long as I absorb traces of the weave from potent enough sources, it remains quiet. Were it ever to fully destabilize, however. Hmm. I'd say... I, will erupt. Erupt. <laughs> I don't know the exact magnitude of the eruption, but given my studies of Netherese magic, I'd say even a fragment as small as the one I carry. And a level a city the size of Waterdeep. Oh. Huh. Is there nothing we can do? Yeah, I'd say so. We might chance upon a king's collection of magical artifacts around the corner. We might cross paths with a miracle round the bend. Then again, we might not. All of this, it must feel like a betrayal. Say the word. And we'll part ways. No, no, we want to keep him around, I'd say. Yeah. That is a great relief. Oh, a great relief indeed. You truly are a soul that steals my own. From all my new rallied heart, I thank you. I thank you all. I understand if you stand against me. I'm humbled if you stand with me. Either way, I will do my best not to let you down. I stand at a precipice, but if you do not give up hope, neither shall I. I'll fight. I'll resist as long as I can. Now, even I am tired of the sound of my own voice. Yes! <laughs> let us venture forth. That was like five minutes of talking he just went through. Okay, I've got Carlash. Um, I'm not gonna even, I don't think I'm gonna even bother her leveling her up. 
I'm just gonna leave camp. Uh, well, I gotta probably gotta end the episode. Uh, well, let's find the blacksmith. I think first, and then we okay. can um, end that. Seems Mole was as good as her word. She's what? reported that you've been threatening children. What the heck? <laughs> I just got. I'm gonna get uh, attacked by that stupid idiot you triggered before. Who <sighs> did I trigger? Oh, I'm gonna get thrown in jail here if I'm not careful. Oh, this is a. I should just use the scroll of charms person on this guy. Um. Just. Let's just go to jail. Oh, there we go. Your words. I... Yeah, I guess that guy is just endlessly hostile to you because you threatened a child for the literal rest of the game. That's annoying. Should I not even bother coming Don't in? Don't go in the grove. <laughs> I'll I talk. went in before and it was fine. Well, I guess he walked into me or something, or else you've already interacted with him. I don't know. But he interacted with me. Maybe it was Carlash? I don't know. Okay. What's your story? I spent a good bit of time in the house. Enlisted against my will by the Archdevil Zariel. Same as you, I suppose, if you're from Elturel. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got mm -hmm. lucky. It looks like you did too. And... You brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Oh, bother. Um, you gotta go get Shadowheart. Yeah. Very hot by the sun. Okay. Because I gave Shad- I think I had Shadowheart carry the infernal iron. Mind if I take a listen? My guest, but don't get too close, or your eyes will melt shut. Um, gotta go drop Gail off. Yeah. Phew. You really are burning up. Whoever put that engine together tried to house metallurgized demano valves inside a Ragnax alloy casement. Very risky. Or at least we need the item she has in her inventory. I'd need infernal iron. And a prayer that might oh, I've already dropped work. Yeah, well, that, uh, that thing isn't meant to operate outside of Vernus. I'm not sure how much longer it'll keep running the way it's going. Will you be able to turn down the temperature a little? Worried I'm gonna go in for a handshake and singe someone's arm off one of these days. I'd worry about surviving the night first. Oh, wow. But help one, help both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine. And allow you to touch whomever you please. Okay. Um. Okay, I'm gonna leave. Let me know when you come back. Okay, I'm coming back now. Shadowheart just gained a ton of XP for some strange reason. I just said Shadowheart gained like a thousand five hundred and eighteen XP. Is she higher level than the rest of us? I uh, know, it must have just caught her up to level four. That's weird. Okay, you've got it. Let's see if this works now. How fast the search? I found the infernal iron. Please let this work. Mm. The weight of it. And that blaze of chaos. Can't also, I'm gonna take the cap be. of curing from Shadowheart, because that's that bar hat, so I can feed it to Gale if he needs it. Ah, yes. Give me just a moment. to install it i'm afraid i don't think there are thick enough gloves in all the realms to protect from that kind of heat impromptu heart surgery that feels good i'm still burning hot as hell's hole but i feel less changeable cheers mate Pleasure. And as for the heat, I haven't got any solutions now, but I'm not giving up. 
could be if the combustion chamber had its own insulation, or if we had some kind of enchanted coolant. Find me again in Boulder's Gate. There we go. If I'm worth my salt, I'll have figured something out by then. Take okay. care, Karlak. There we go. And hopefully okay. the next time I see you, I'll have something promising to report. Pocket any infernal iron you find along the way, hmm? Okay, that's all for us then. I guess we'll go slaughter goblins next episode? Actually, no, we're gonna go have refugee fun, right? Yeah, party time! Actually, wait, Carlac wants to talk. One quick second. Damon's upgrade didn't cool me down, but it did juice me up. Oh, cool, she's stronger now. I don't think I've ever felt more powerful. Cool. Sooner rather than later would be good. I feel like I'm burning serious fuel. Uh, I need something to burn then. I don't think talking to him again will do anything. Nope, okay. That's it from us then.